say that I visited the Open Course Library site uh, for this course and I clicked on the link here to get to the Google Docs collection where all of the course materials are housed and I clicked download and I downloaded the uh, entire content collection for this course as a series of PDFs. I chose PDFs for my different options here. And now I'm in Angel and I want to use those documents. Um, one thing that I could do, see I don't have any lesson content in this course, I could go to the Manage tab and I can click on the Import Console. And I can choose to import a content package and browse to find the zip file that I downloaded. And I can upload that file. It's going to ask me some questions about the about the content, where I want it listed in the course. All right, so it's found it's found that this file that I uploaded is a zip file. It recognizes that, and it wants to know if I want to um, have the content appear just at the root level of my lessons tab, or in an existing folder, or to make a new folder. And I'll just call I'll make a new folder and I'll call it Art 100. And I can tell it what types of files to look for. Uh, just document files such as PDFs or HTML files, multimedia. In this case, I'm just going to leave those defaults as they are. It tells me what subfolders the different content items are going to be put in. And it tells me that uh, my content is being processed. Uh, unless you have an unusually large content collection, this shouldn't take more than a few minutes. It might take up to a day if there are many, many files, but um, in most cases it'll just take a few minutes. All right, so I waited for a few minutes, and I'm back in my course again now. And I go to the Lessons tab, and now I see that there is a folder here for Art 100. And within it, I can find uh, all of the folders and files that were in the content I downloaded from the Open Course Library site. And I created uh, that zip file and chose uh, Word documents as my format that I wanted. And I can see that the, that the content that I exported from the Google site is now available in my Angel course. And it's in the same nested folder format that the per person who created it set it as, uh, but uh, Angel sees all of these as discrete content items, so I can um, move them around or rename them or do whatever I want to do with them. They're not, I'm not stuck with the file structure that I was given by the people who put the content together.